Hey guys, good morning. It's Tony. Before I shot the video, uh, I said please like, subscribe, and comment. If you want to join the Patreon, go to www.patreon.com slash but I'm not a trader, and I will be honest with you guys. Yesterday's uh, push, I had no idea this was going to happen. And I'll be honest with you, I am confused as fuck as to what is going on right now because I did not expect this push to the upside at all. Not even close, bro. Um, and I'm even more confused because the dollar is still fucking running up too, which is what I don't understand. <laughs> so the dollar is still pushing up super hard. Um, shout out to GME. GME fucking went bonkers, bro. I love it. Oops. I hate when that happens. I hate when I like that thing gets stuck. See this thing? Oh. Get up. We gotta get that out. There you go. Okay, so again, I have no idea what is going on right now, and I'll be honest. If you know, I think for the most part right now, the only thing that I can say is that we're probably gonna go to this resistance, this resistance at four one seven five, and then reject. But I have not been. Uh, you know, extremely confident in in you know in what's going on in these last after this after this going on, I have no idea what's going on, bro. So you know, for now, get your TA from somebody else, <laughs> honestly, because this is this is crazy, bro. I have no idea, you know, what is going on or why we keep pushing like this. I know yesterday there was news that uh, somebody said some from you know, whatever said it, that, you know, they could have a resolution on the debt ceiling thing by Sunday. Um, keep in mind that if that actually does happen, we could shoot up straight to like 420, 430. If that doesn't happen, we're going to drop extremely hard. But I'll be honest, I did not expect this move to the upside at all. I had no idea this, this I had no idea this squeeze was going to happen, right? Or that the market was going to react so hard to this. Um, and you're even breaking 415, you know, you broke that major resistance right now. You're breaking that right now, right? Pre-market, which is extremely bullish. So as of right now, my guess is you could probably see 417 today, man. This squeeze is unreal to me, right? And the fact that you're actually moving the same direction um, with the same direction with the dollar, it's kind of insane to me, right? The fact that you're still pushing up on the dollar and you're still breaking highs, right? And spy is still breaking highs. They're, they're essentially moving the same way, the same direction, and it's extremely. You know, I'm I'm confused as fuck. I'll be honest. I have no idea what's going on right now. I have no idea what, you know, you know what is happening. And then for right now, I think. I mean, I'm still holding my long term puts for June, but I think for the most part, I'm just going to be short term trading because this is this is insane, bro. I have no idea what exactly is is actually going on here, right? Um, so it, it makes no sense to me. Absolutely no sense why we still keep pushing. And again, the only thing that I can see is that you're, you're still retesting major levels, right? So again, if you want the daily, you know, you do have this, you know, you do have this trend here, right? On the spy came in, still got lows, right? You broke here, still chilling and you're retesting right here. And again, you have that same thing right here on the SPX. Same thing on SPX. Right, same thing here. I mean, this is exactly what happened. You retested, right? But you're still chilling up here on the upper side. So I don't understand why you keep pushing up. The only thing that I can see is, again, you, you keep pushing to 417 and then you dump from there. But honestly... I'll, I'll be honest, I, I have no idea what's going on because this keeps pumping for some reason and the DXY keeps pushing up as well. So for now, get your TA from somebody else. I'll do other TA for you guys. But as far as the SPY goes, um, the only reason that I can think that it's going up is just because, you know, the NASDAQ is holding it up, bro. I mean, look at that. You just broke major resistance from 13.5. This is crazy. I mean, this is this is essentially a bull market, bro. Like This is, this is essentially a bull market. The fact that you're running... You know this hot this high on you know let me see if i can get some nice resistance here yeah essentially that's you know essentially that you're running this hot on on a on on the market when you know your inflation is still possibly coming in higher right and yeah i'll stop right there 
where your inflation is possibly still coming in higher and things are still bad like this is extremely surprising to me the only thing that i can see is that you double top right here and you dump from there but honestly bro i i am confused af and i have no idea what's going on right now i mean the nasdaq still has quite a way to go before you actually do come back to this only trend that i could see right here right but again I mean, if you're breaking major resistance here, the next stop for, for the NASDAQ is 14.4. And if you go on the SPX, right, if you break that 417, right, you know, 417, you're going on like 430, bro. Like if you break this to the upside, right, if you break these highs, the only thing that I see is 432. And I'm confused as fuck as to why we're actually pushing this hard on a bear week, right? Because we just closed the bear week. This past week, right? Last, not the, like last Friday, right? So I'm extremely surprised that this squeeze is happening on a bear week, right? Because essentially, you just see a straight shot down, right? Again, close the bear week, shot down, bear week, straight shot down, bear week, right? You just, you did a full engulfing bull candle on this, and then there's a chance that you just keep pushing from that. So I, I have no idea what's going on, bro. I am confused. The dollar keeps running as well, which is extremely weird to me. I don't know why it's running. Um, but, you know, I think this level is definitely a high short level up here. If you want to do short term, I can definitely see this coming back down hard from this high up here. Other than that, I don't know, bro. I have no idea what's going on. You're already breaking major resistance at 415 right here on the spot, right? Last time you were here, you know, how much, how much, how much time did you spend here? Yeah, I mean, you could see it like a triple top here, right? I mean, you do have you do have the start of what could be a triple top, which is extremely, extremely rare, right? You could see a triple top, uh, top and then drop from here, right, essentially, and just go straight down like that. But, yeah, this is weird as fuck, bro. I'll be honest. I have no idea what's going on. I'll see you guys later. Bye.